we met on um, an internet dating site. Um, I'd been single for a while and thought I'd try my luck. We met at Tai Chi. There was this class we used to go to every morning in the park. And um, whilst at the class, I don't think we said two words to each other, did we? No. And um, I did that sort of, uh, do you want to go for a drink then? I sort of go, yeah, OK. And I invited everyone back to mine. And Steve was the only taker. We sort of became friends through being adventure scouts together, believe it or not, and then uh, oh, stay God. friends ever since. We met at, um, at college. Um, I was Tony's <laughs> <laughs> manager, and uh, we met in the art department at, at the college. We're both teachers. And we've uh, always sort of been going out with other people, and then we found each other um, single at the same time, and um, the rest is history, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we had a film school about 14 years ago up in London and we decided that, you know, along the line we wanted to have a family but we wanted to get a film off the ground first of all. I always remember uh, on, on your profile, Simon's profile, it said children and he put not sure or undecided and I was like, mm, you know, you're trying to psychologically read into what this means. Right, well... That's we, a bit of a story. It's <laughs> a bit of a story because we didn't really plan it that well. Yeah. Um, we weren't really trying for a baby, we were trying to move house. I had polycystic ovaries, I'd been diagnosed about 10 years earlier, so I knew it wasn't going to be quite that simple to get pregnant and I knew that we might need some medical intervention or I would, um, either surgery or medication. Um, so I did sort of kind of prepare you for that, didn't I? Say yeah. it might not happen overnight, it might be a year down the line, but you know, if we've both committed to the idea, let's, let's go for it. So we made our first fe feature film last year and uh, pretty much straight away we found out we were pregnant. We'd been together for about six months before we decided to have a baby. Uh, maybe we could have planned more in advance, the kind of thing we, you know, needed to do. Um, but we just thought we'd get on with it, I think, and, uh, you know, let the natural things take over, really. The moon's in the right position, we've got half an hour, let's do it now. <laughs> and it seemed to work, didn't it? It seemed to work, and lo and behold, yeah, it was, it was um, New Year's Eve, wasn't it, we actually conceived? We worked Looking out, back on it? Yes, that it was, uh, it was our... Well, what turned out to be our last hurrah of debauchery. All loved up, yeah. In uh, a local club in Brighton on New Year's that's Eve. That's not where we conceived. No, it's not but... where we conceived, but uh, afterwards <laughs> um, we worked out that it must have been that particular yeah. night. Yeah.